Very recently, I was walking out of an elevator in a hotel in Hollywood, California, and as I was coming out of the elevator, I turned and looked, and I was face to face with John Waters, who was coming into the elevator. I flipped, I flipped out. My voice raised one or two octaves. I said, oh my God, John, I fucking love you. And he turned around, he's in the elevator. I'm like almost walking back into the elevator. And uh, I shake his hand and I, and I say, John, I, I, you've been such a huge inspiration to me. I mean, since I was in high school, before that. And he said, oh, thank you. I'm like, my name's Davey, so my name's John. And the elevator door is shut. I've met um, many people who have inspired me. I never had really reacted that way in my life. I'd been prepared for it, or I maybe had seen them on the cross room before I, I went to punish them about how much I love them. This was just so shocking to me that I, I really couldn't contain myself and I completely lost my cool. And he was very gracious and lovely and he looked great. And, uh, and then the elevator closed and John Waters got away. I was at the movies one time and I saw Eddie Watanabe, AKA Long Duck Dong from 16 Candles. And I'm like, there's Long Duck Dong. It's one of my favorite movies of the 80s. So I went up and I, I'm, it's the only picture I've ever taken with a celeb. He seemed very psyched to be recognized and have a picture taken with him. So living in Los Angeles, you see tons of celebs. You see a famous person every day. But that was the only one that I was like, yeah, I gotta get a picture with Long Duck Dong.